I feel so lucky to be here. Sports Illustrated has been on my radar for my entire career, and to me it represents so much more than just models. It's about business women, and this issue in particular, it's about so much more. When I first found out about the issue and the concept, I was so excited. Not only was it my first Sports Illustrated issue experience, but it's just so special. It represents so much more than just a body. Um, I really had to dig deep for everything that I wanted to put on my body, for everything I wanted to portray, and it was a lot of my fears and insecurities transformed into body paint, which is awesome. The process of finding what I wanted to put on my body was a lot of self-discovery. I had to spend a lot of time in my thoughts thinking about really what I really did struggle with. I wanted to make myself as vulnerable as I could. What did you end up painting on your body? Um, I have a few things. My back says beauty is not perfection. My arm says love transforms, pain shapes us. The side of my leg says stand in your truth. And there's a few other ones. You'll have to check it out. No, I, can't, I can't wait to see it. Have you been hazed at all? And what would supermodels do for hazing if they did indeed haze? Oh my gosh, I wonder. Well, today I had to do an interview, and they made us eat like a chicken wing every time that we every time we did something. I don't know. It was weird. But anyway, it wasn't that bad. I love chicken wings. <laughs> the rigmarole surrounding the swimsuit issue. How have you found that compared to something like being Miss Universe? Both of those were career milestones, but in particular, I just feel so lucky to be surrounded by so many incredible women. Tonight, I felt the same way when I won Miss Universe. You know, I'm around so many um, smart, intelligent, driven women, and I'm learning from everyone, really.